So it's late summer, the beginning of August, and pretty much this time of year, maximum stress has been exerted on the trees in terms of drought and heat. And it's definitely showing in the Arbor Vitae section. This one is Thuja occidentalis nigra, and you can see it's got a big dead spot at the bottom. But what you might not be able to tell on the video is that the whole tree has started to lose color and go yellow. And maybe you can tell by looking at these fallen branches here, that's not normal for an Arbor Vitae. My theory is this is due to Armillaria root rot. And this has been a bigger problem on the emerald green Arbor Vitaes, but this is the first time I've seen it really affect the Thuja occidentalis nigra. And it was an exceptionally dry, hot summer for a while there. I didn't put too much supplemental water on these trees, so they were drought stressed, and that may have given the fungus a chance to do what it was going to do eventually anyway. And here's the emerald green arbor vitae. I've made plenty of videos about this one being killed by the fungus. There's last year's dead stump, which still hasn't been removed uh, because I had a bunch of stumps to remove and never got to it. There's another one. And then here's another one with them. Um, you can see dead in the middle there and uh, this left side over here has already gone pale yellow or almost white. And at the bottom, I've been kind of chopping away at the fungus, or sorry, at the uh, trunk here to try to reveal the fungus. And I think I've succeeded. See this white here? There's bits of white there on the inside the trunk. This is inside the tree. So that normally wouldn't be there. It's a little harder to tell on the trunk. Right here, you can see all this white here is fungal mycelium which shouldn't be there and I'm curious to know if I can find some more here yeah look at that you can see this area I just revealed so the tree is dying up top it's got the fungus inside the tree at the bottom. I don't know m how much more conclusive you can be that that is what is killing the tree. Now, did the tree get drought stressed and become susceptible to the fungus? Probably, but I would still say the fungus is the proximate cause of death for these trees. And, uh, you know, as a control, my whole collection has been subjected to drought stress. And they're not all dying, so these are um, a combination of maybe fungus and drought is what's killing these. And I see other people losing these due to drought, what I assume is drought alone, but maybe they also have fungus. But this uh, Thuja occidentalis, of all the species I've had, um, that one and uh, the emerald green giant, sorry, Thuja green giant, uh, which is also a Thuja genus tree, those have been the ones that I believe have been lost due to root rot.